huge plea for fosters right now. We are back in our cat stray area. Um, some of you may have been back here before, others maybe not. This is actually where the cats first come in. Um, this is where a lot of your fosters are waiting until they come into your homes. We have currently 28 cats and kittens that we need to find foster for. As you can see, I mean, literally about every cage is full down here, um, and we have kittens coming in daily. So our first little guy, this little five-week-old black and white kitty, um, has a, is on Clavamox, had a bot fly removed, but is doing very well. Seems to be eating okay. Down here, we have a mom with babies. I'm pretty sure Rachel posted these guys yesterday. Look how adorable. Mom's very, very sweet. Many of you may be shying away from moms and babies. I can tell you from experience, it usually is so great. Mom does all the work. Um, we get you a, a nice little cage or playpen big enough for the whole family, and you get to watch them grow up, which is really awesome. So we're going to go around this way. Another set of mom, a, a mom I should say, with newborn kittens. I believe there are five in there. Again, all doing really well. Mom's a really great mom. She's been caring for them really, really well and feeding everybody really nicely. We have, making sure I don't forget anybody, <laughs> this little adorable nugget. This one might be a good buddy for our little black and white friend on the front wall too. Um, about the same size, super, super cute. Look at that fluff. Adorable. <laughs> <laughs> super sweet. We're gonna go back this way, I believe. We have yet another set of moms, a mom with babies. Peek Look at the little orangies. Mom, again, super, super sweet, doing a great job. These babies are a little bit bigger, so mom may not have to be with them too much longer. We just want to make sure they get properly weaned and that they're eating okay on their own so they don't start dropping weight. On our back wall here, we have two more. I'm going to let Rachel zoom in there and just kind of let them hang out because the one is snoozing. One itty-bitty little fluff and another little calico tiger kitty super sweet. We may even have more kittens coming in today, so that's why we're going to this extreme, asking you guys for help. So if you've been on a little bit of break and you're ready for more kittens, please reach out to Rachel and I so we can get these guys, get these guys out of here as quick as we can so they're not just sitting here and getting ill. Thanks guys.